Yeah, I gave him the key. He lost the key. Okay, but well, you just said every time he takes new keys, I have to change the whole house again. I get like he does that. It's, it's lost somewhere at the nursing home, so he needs the mail. The, the Section 8 people sent the papers, and it's another document that should be in the mailbox. This card here, you have to fill out. Next, I'm not necessarily going to be here because I'm not standing at any unit. We have a unit that's been approved already, but it's a here, let me get that part. You have to approve me being in the unit with him, but technically I'm not going to be here because I'm not living like that. So okay, you know, but Deborah just called me and told me, is that moving? Huh? She just told me she's moving. This is what we're doing. We, I'm done with one process and everything, and we, and so you, but for section eight to move him, you have to put it's a part in here that you have to fill out. Yeah, I need to turn this over to the owner's because I don't put this out for the owner's though. Amen. No, it's for the, it's just said for the management. Well, but I don't, I don't, I don't sign nothing. It's, okay, I don't, I just, if you think I give it to the it's owner. It says, it says owner, of, it says approval for adult household, which is difficult, and then it's just declaring that it's okay for me to be in the unit. I, mean, I don't give it to the owner. I don't sign nothing. I don't sign nothing here at all. I give it to them. Why well, soon can the owner, um. If he hit it tomorrow, he picks up his, he ain't got the rent, but he'll figure out tomorrow, he'll be tomorrow. Cause I don't sign, I don't sign nothing here except these receipts saying I got their money. Other than that, I don't sign nothing here. So I can leave. I'm gonna leave. You can leave with me, and I'll get it to them with the sign. Okay. So the owner have to approve. It. Let me put my name on there. I um, he got to sign his name. You know he probably done did this a couple times. I don't sign nothing. Okay, what I need is the mail for these people sent me declaration, okay, but the other documents that I have to fill out. See, I got his signature already. On okay, this, I need to turn to I have to get, now I gotta figure out, catch the mailman, see if they'll give me his mail. Because you, I, I, what I go let me do is change his lock. They won't give me his mail. Well, you can't get the mail out the box? I can change the lock, but I can't get the mail. So if you change the light, then that means you'll be able to open the mail. Yeah, but I can't see what she did. The mailman is standing there. I can't see. Can't, you what you what I can do is send it back, and you can get it from there. But you can give me mail with my name on it. Because I have my name on it, my, and I have my ID, so my name is what I'm on. Well, then you need to catch the mailman. They, not, they, you they, know what, Doug? No, so you guys want me to do wrong. I'm not doing wrong. I'm, I'm not. not, period. I'm stop doing that. But, but Doug, let me say this. We have a tenant, you understand the situation and the circumstances. Our, our position here is to expedite this, this position so he can get out the property. He gave you the 30 day notice. When you intercept like this and don't allow us to transition through, it makes it more complex. Okay, but then okay, but you're making it tough on me also. Now you want me to stay here and wait for the mailman. No, I didn't ask you to wait for the mailman. I know you have access. Because if you could change the locks, that means you can open up the okay, mailbox. I can open up the mailbox and change the lock. I cannot take but, them out. But in order for this man to make his transition, why is it? Why would y'all make it so? Because complex? I can't. I cannot. But okay, it. but you can allow me access to the unit. No, I mean, I let mean, you have access to the unit. I've already given you guys a key, so I mean, you but can. But he me. lost the key. And I get just the other day. I gave him a key. I know. I brought him here. And I gave him a key. Gave him everything then. You just gave him the you, one key. He that. So he, he lost it since then. Yes, it's lost. That's why we can't get in the unit. Or check the mailbox. Because you gave me keys and I got keys made. And I had got an extra key. I do have an extra mailbox key. Now, if anybody's in one of my purses, something told me get an extra mailbox key. It's in one of the purses, so I do have a mailbox key. I got an extra one. It's laying on one of my purses, on the floor of my purse. Okay. Can I park in number 11? I'm only going to be here for two hours. 14, 13, 14. Is that open? Well, you know, I'm not I mean, I'm, you, you try, everybody trying to that's not my job, I'm the manager. You, you're the manager, okay. and it's not your job to, to sign and do anything. No, that's it. Well, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Okay. The other manager that approved the unit that is, 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 is in um, by the, uh, Hamishaw, 
that he's already approved for the union, all that went through. Um, She's she going to be the manager. She, she already proven maybe she could fill this out. So it would satisfy the execution of him being processed out of here. So I think, what manager, should it make a difference with manager? Because I ain't going to be able to get that worker on the phone to ask her. Because as long as the management signed or approved that I am going to be in that unit, you know. We're over there. But the whole, because he's currently here, it would come to you. So he can transition. All you're doing is saying that I mean, it's okay for me to live in the unit with him. I'm not going to live here. I'm just going to move him into the unit that I'm going to live with him in. And that's that's a process, and that's going to hold up the application process. We're trying to get him out of there. And all this way to the mine, and the people come. I come over to mine. The man ain't here. He can't catch him. He went somewhere. That's that's crazy. You know, to, to, you see that we're trying to get the situation out under control, and hey, you see, won't allow you it. Know, you know, somebody did you do before? I got coach, I got some bullshit to avoid it cost me seven months, and I don't let that happen to me again. This is not no bullshit. You but already I, know I, what I, I got you. But think, I don't, since that happened, I signed for something that cost me seven, I don't sign for shit no more. Cost me money. Well, it appears to me you don't want the man out of the, off the property. It appears to me you want him here because y'all not making it easy for him to, 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 to make his exit. Because this is complex. Because Doug, you know my circumstances situation. I don't have a way to go. I got to catch the bus on and I have a life in other business too. So when I come to attend to the business, it's always a factor that I can't go forward. It's always a struggle. You see the man, 86 years old, he's going through this, but when I came to you before, your, your rest was, I don't give a fuck, I don't give a fuck. And that's not fair to not give a fuck about a tenant that is yours and we're trying to process him about it. The man is old and feeble and somebody said to help him. His sister got to fly in from Texas. We're trying to get him stable and y'all making it complex. I don't understand why the blocks are not up here. What, the wall, what are the walls here for? Okay, because I really don't get it. That's simple. I mean, I don't know why anyone can do it. So, but you, don't, you don't care, and I understand you don't care, but of those who do care, we're asking you to do your job so you can get extra blood like this circumstance and get this man up out of here. That is not hard. You won't have to see me tip toes, no McKees. We're trying to go and kill this situation. And the mailman will start running after 5 o'clock and all that kind of craziness. Well, I'm going to get out of here at 3.30. I don't sit right away with nobody. Okay, I got tickets on signature on that. And that's too much. I, because I didn't have my glasses. Here I'm going through it. I got to to run up to the nursing home and have them sign this. I could catch the bus to section A because I have all the documents filled out. That's the only thing that was holding up the process. Them allowing me on it so they could put me on the thing so I can give them. Oh, so I'm not an immigrant, so. But this is taking you a tenant disappointment. Right, but I'm not here. Process the process has been approved. So, okay, I need to tell them. You're not going to get caught up in that. We're trying to get the man out of here. It's nothing to get caught up in. Yeah, that's what I got some out. You know, you know, people here tell me that shit and I get caught up. Okay. That's some shit and then it costs me some money. It's not going to cost you a dime when you're just giving him favor to get the hell up out of this damn place. You know, just, I'm not going to go. Make sure I got everything. Mm -hmm. Marker. So let me see a yellow marker. And make sure. Mm -hmm. and we got to go all the way back. I may burn me too many times. Well, I just stabbed it. He already signed you this far. He signed that part. Yeah. So when you guys going to have him out of here? Well, because the place is in, it's on Kerry over there. It's not quite too long. But yet, or But the shoes are fish. Um, but, but, but. What did she say that? about the other male and all that? Nothing to me about no man. But what did she say to me? Did you, did you recall what she said to me? Yeah. Do you remember she said, oh, call Doug? She said, because I talked to Ivy, yeah. but I talked about the key and all that old stuff. And I said, okay. So she said, so then she I said, that. and she said, because you got the documentation, and, you know, and I said, Doug, I'm have to fill out this form. But you just say, you don't know nothing about I it. Don't the key. Nothing. That's crazy. But I got a piece of paper, I can write this out. Okay, she can get his rent. And right, he's supposed to be, and he's supposed to pay him. Overnight expressing. Okay, okay, okay. 
And, and she said that you are um, a maintenance fee or something about uh, damage is damage is damage is damage. You scared all off. That's all I know. Right. And That's what were the damages? The, the, the four hundred twenty nine dollars. For what? For the damages that which place got flooded. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. All right, and I got this here. Let me, I need the paper. Cause we gotta go to the, um, mm -hmm. now let's just head to the house. No, he's in the nursing home. He's in the nursing home. I'm handling all his business. I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm taking it. My name is on stuff I need, they need to, they're trying to add me on. So I'm giving documents out so I can actually on. Because Tippy gave her the permission to add me on so she got to do a background check and you got to go to the other county. I don't know about that. I'm okay. sharing what? It's paying, so it's in the check, that's all.